Hi guys, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In the previous video, we have seen how to create the React project using the create react app command. We have seen it. Now this is the output which we will be able to see when you type the command npm start. So fine. So now this is the project structure. We already seen about the project structure. Now what I will try to do is I will we will try to develop the project. So from first onwards, we will develop the project. So there will be no topics covering and all those things. In between this one, I will cover the topics and we'll do the project one by one and we'll do some couple of projects. Now here, so what I've been doing is, so here, this is our source, right? So I am deleting all the files from here, from here to here. These are the, all the files from here to here. I will delete it literally. We'll try to do it from first onwards. So if I delete this all project and here you'll be able to see the output that module cannot found app.css and all those things. So here the first one which is important is the index.js file. So let's create index.js file. Index.js file I have created. Now we need to import the react. So import react from react. We'll write it from scratch onwards. So we need to import the react. Previously we have used something like script src like this, right? But here we need to import the react. And also import the react dom from react dom slash client okay so this is also we need to import it so fine so we have imported all the necessary features whichever is uh, uh, needed for us now it's time for us to write a function so function app so this is our component okay now here so what i want to do constant root is equal to so we need to get the root react dom react dom dot create root so we need to have a create root so here the create root we will be getting it from the index.html okay so the index.html so this is our id root so this is our id root now here i will be adding document dot document dot get element by id of i will be using this root so hopefully this one works now what i need to do i need to use root dot render of app oh not not this app so we will do app like this so that's it so now we have we have used the root dot render dot app now now here let's add return uh, h1 hello react i will write it like this so let's press semicolon and save it so hopefully this should work. Let's refresh this page. Maybe. Yeah. Now we are able to see the output. If I do some semi, if I keep some semicolons and all those things, so you will be able to see the output. So here, what I am trying to do, I am opening the project in a separate, in a, in a side window and I am writing the code here so that we can have a clear uh, understanding. So what I am trying to write it. So this is how we will be writing the create react app. And what we have did is, so we have run this system. So this is the simple thing which we will be writing. And now onwards, we will write the code from scratch onwards. From scratch, we will be writing this code. So what I will try to do is, I will commit this code. In the next video, we will see how we can debug and all those things. So I will commit this code in our GitHub URL. Whoever may be having doubts or anything, if you want to refer the code, so you can go to this GitHub repository URL. So that GitHub is nothing but react 18 hyphen course. Okay. So this is our react 18 hyphen code. So this is the thing. And here I have created a basic react. So which I have implemented that one using a pure react code. So without using the NPM tools, whichever the code I have written, I have given it here. Whatever the projects I will be trying to create, I will create it like a folders here. So now this one, I will commit this all the code. Uh, what I will try to do is, so this is our main code, right? So here I will commit this all the code or otherwise here we can uh, push it. So let's push these all the things and i have pushed it so here i will be writing um, initial commit pizza app okay so i am committing this all code so let's commit this all the code fine sync the changes so now if you try to see the output for this one uh, let let it let it commit and here automatically the code will be updated here let's refresh this page Maybe it will be taking, yeah, yeah, pizza app, you are able to get it here. So if you want to get the code means, so you can clone this code, you can clone this one, pizza app, this is the one code and you can clone it here and you can download it 
whatever the thing you can do it so here whatever the projects i will be creating in this react 18 iphone course i will create one by one here whoever may be having a doubts and if you want to refer the code means they can go to this one and also i will create a branch from next video you know, video onwards i will create a branch with the video number whatever the video number it is there with that video number i will create a branch whoever wants to get the take for the reference means of the particular video you can go it so this uh, uh, github repository url will be provided in the description below of this video for of every video it will be provided from now onwards so you for every reference you can refer to this one so that's it guys in the next video we will see some more details about the pizza app uh, code so hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you